Well, this stadium was clearly visible from the top of Table Mountain yesterday afternoon on a glorious sunny day. Someone's laid a thick tablecloth of cloud over the mountain today. It's decidedly gloomy here. Let's hope that this match can really brighten things up at the southernmost tip of Africa. Going to the World Cup for the first time since 1966, and they go to the draw, and it's Brazil, Ivory Coast, Portugal, and themselves. Couldn't get any help. Transfer window. Carlos Queiroz saying he wants his team to be more adventurous here in this second match. They did themselves great credit in the match at Ellis Park the other day against Brazil. They frustrated the Brazilians for the best part of an hour. Although, first chance to see him today. The deflection carrying the Ismarelsh. Struggling to clear Ricardo Carvalho up inside the penalty area. Finding Ronaldo. It'll turn away from Lund in Go. Go up. Ricardo Carvalho with the header. And North Korea saved by the frame of the goal. Well, the goalkeeper. Fika and at international level as well. Beautiful pass uh, offside given against Almeida. Having a good little spell of possession here. Might fall kindly for Cha Chong Hyuk with a shot. Well, that's more like it. We didn't see anything like that against Brazil till the last two minutes. Well, they look like they fancy it. They're certainly not sitting back and getting forward like they were in the first five minutes or so. Ronaldo. Playing instead of Yedson today. There's Eusebio. Paknam Chol with the ball to that far side, and Miguel's got his hands full over there. That's Ji Young Nam forward. Dong Tai Se with a chance, and it just slips away. Almeida waits inside the box. Simao there too. Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's the captain now, Hong Yong Jo. Support coming into the penalty area. The initial block and the header over the top. Well, that was a chance there. Great strike from Hong Young Jo back and, and having to defend. They're both having a go, yeah. Hong Young Huck with the shot. Great defending. Morelsh. BBC HD. Another opportunity. Stood still and beat him. Morelsh. Might try one from distance. It was an untimely. It's looking rather wet in that corner, but it's a decent ball. Morelsh making the run into the penalty area. Round the Relsh for Portugal. 28 minutes played and Portugal score at the World Cup for the first time in 2010. And it's Morelsh of Porto. Timed his run to perfection. Well, I'm glad I called it about midfield runners because they were never going to break them down just with a one striker playing it into. It's a theme. Have their noses in front just before the half-hour mark here in Cape Town. Publicity and new media he needs to deliver on the pitch. Here's Thiago. Oh, terrible mistake, Morelis was nearly in there. There's Jong Tai Se. Quintrao. Sliding in there was Cha Jong Hyuk. Portugal rather unhappy at the awarding of uh, that free kick to North Korea. He's near the ball too. Hong Yong Jo, and it's just nearly knocks Ricardo Carvalho's head off. Comfortable in the end for just, Eduardo. Just hit his head. Just watch other all. They could do with half-time arriving sharpish. This is Cristiano Ronaldo. Always going wide. Yeah, this is the first we've really seen of it. I know he had the shot early on that was deflected, but it wasn't really a, a great effort. This is a bit better. He might have got away from the full-back here for the first time in quite a while. Indeed he has! And Almeida tried a flick to squeeze to uh, Simao. He's away from Ri Quang Chon. Simao in towards Morel. Cristiano Ronaldo is... It's when he was bundled over, he sat on the floor. Well, as we go into the second 45 minutes, North Korea... Everybody, especially the good football inside. But he's playing one up front, it's not easy. Well, they've got a... Seems to have had a conveyor belt of, of wingers. Ronaldo there now, in towards Thiago. Teeing himself up. Corner. 
Sometimes it's difficult to get. Midfield around five years ago. Here's the captain, Hong Yong Jo. No power layoff, and uh, North Korea getting into a spot of bother. It's into Ronaldo, and it's into the crowd. Well, that a great. Uh, promising play from Portugal. Cristiano Ronaldo with the shot, and that ball causes problems. They're playing yeah. a bit narrow, you know, Portugal. Ronaldo and Samoa are playing narrow. He's as frustrated as everybody else, but he does show it, doesn't he? He just wish he'd get into it. He shows his frustration. Look, he's there. Played back to Jong Tai Se. Comfortably behind the ball, Eduardo. Well, there was a little interchange there with Ji Yun Nam. Now, Miguel. Jong Tai Se is the player down on the floor. Midfielder in the first half. Cristiano Ronaldo. He's got some support here for him. Fabro Trao in towards Almeida. You know, one of the top sides. Great ball from Miguel. Lovely layoff. Morelli, Morel, and 2 0. Simao for Portugal. They double their lead. And again, a lovely passing move. John Kock losing out. Cristiano Ronaldo onside. Flag stays down. Might open up here. Almeida making the run. Tiago with a shot. 4 0 Portugal. And it's turning into a rout. We haven't quite played for an hour here. And Portugal, who finished fourth in the World Cup four years ago, have four goals to celebrate here against North Korea. Well, Chung Tai Se going for the ball with uh, Ricardo. At least give them a little foothold in the match. Or some measure of consolation. Oh, maybe hit the ball forward now towards Cristiano Ronaldo. Chance for Morales! North Korea survived that particular onslaught. Well, Morales has been. So often the fulcrum of the midfield, the pivotal point of which so much of the. Neat approach play and the shot coming through you know, to get to the World Cup finals. High boot there, I think, by Ricardo Carvalho. John Tai has done well. Yeah. Bringing for North Korea. Cristiano Ronaldo, Simao's in space, they might not need him, it's why. Four goals to the good though, Portugal. Cristiano Ronaldo, Portugal's players looking like they're really enjoying themselves now. A lovely dummy, Hong Yong Jo into the penalty area, in towards Jong Tai Se. First time now it's with Ronaldo, Cristiano Ronaldo gaining ground and letting fly. Very unlucky. Well, that's him, he was playing on the right, coming on his left before, he's now... ...only came by the playoffs. Here's Cristiano Ronaldo, losing problems have come ill. Jong Tai Se. Header away by uh, Lee Jung Il. Find its way to Cristiano Ronaldo. To, uh, find a way through. The massed red ranks at the back. Jong Tai Se with the miscue, which... Portugal threaten once more, in towards Lietzon, and it's five! Lietzon virtually with his first touch of the ball, after coming on as a substitute. Five of the best from Portugal, five star, five nil. It'll not get an easier one, will he? He's not had to work very hard to get this chance. Now John there with his forehead towards Ronaldo. Oh, it's deflected Ronaldo's way. Surely it's the sixth goal, and Cristiano Ronaldo puts the icing on Portugal's cake. 6-0, three minutes to go. And well, finally, the biggest name. Enough for North Korea's tired players here now. As we have a seventh goal, Tiago, second of the game, a magnificent seven for Portugal. A timely intervention there by Pak Jolchin. And still, North Korea work as hard as they possibly can, but they have been on the end of a royal thrashing here, the likes of which you do not see very often at the highest level of the international game.